Bobby, drive carefully. Don't get me killed now. I'm going to do my okay. best, sir. Good morning, everybody. It is Wednesday, April 3rd, 2024. And uh, if we survive the journey, good morning, Bobby. Good morning. We're gonna and be, how are you? <laughs> we're going to be, we're heading over to the boss and Janice to do a little Easter visit here today. We're still in the octave of Easter, so we're going to see what they're doing. Lord knows, I hope the boss is in a good mood today because <laughs> I'm a little worried because a lot of the stuff on the fish tank went bad down there. Oh, you know, wow. that really space age fish tank setup. Wow. Uh, the boss might be a victim of technological complication. <laughs> <laughs> that and, and and that fish tank is high end. That's what I'm saying, man. He might just might just be technological overload there with too many too many parts that it might go bad. I don't know. I I would just throw a couple of nice goldfish in and, <laughs> and give them the time of their life. Anyway, guys, it is a uh, an overcast day today. We have another bit of rain coming in for the next couple days. Hopefully. The rain will hold off until we get back to uh, Santa Rosa this afternoon. I think Janet, they have an appointment to take Zoe in this afternoon. For, oh, do they? For a checkup, because of course Zoe has diabetes, so uh, has to have regular doctor checkups once in a while. Get blood tests on and stuff like that. So uh, Zoe was looking good when we were there. And, yes. Uh, you yes, know, yes, it's, she was. Uh, you know, it's, uh, Spunky, 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 barking, happy, jumping around. And jumping around. So, not much of video today. It's kind of a yucky, funky day. So, we'll just see you when we get over. Overcast. There. And just in case this is my last video and you find this in the wreckage. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Adios. What are we doing? Are you cleaning up for me? No, no shoes on? Huh? No. no what are we sorry. doing? Give me a hug. Yeah. Boss, how are you doing today? Good to see Good you. Good to see you. Happy Easter visit this is for you. I'm doing a well wellness check down here. Are we doing laundry? We got a problem? We got a little laundry. We got a little bit of laundry. The boss is so domesticated now. Uh, so like I was telling you guys... <laughs> <laughs> no, I, 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 I have it on video. Myself, I have, I have oh, it on video. Good to see you. Happy Easter, all. <laughs> I got the boss on video doing it. Zoe! Zoe! What's up, Zoe? What are you doing? Uh, Zoe, huh? How you doing, Zoe? What are you doing, huh? There you are. You got an appointment today to get checked out? Yeah, they had to they had to send the boss a new something because things were crapping out in the tank. I tank looks you, good though. I see. Tank looks nice. Zoe, Zoe see we see you. Did Bobby scare you? Oh, you're okay. There we go. Bobby, don't scare the dog. Yeah, you're the oh, come on, Bobby. Knock it off. Don't be mean today. So he's looking good. Here we go. The boss has got something new here. This I didn't see before uh, inside here. But this is the old pump from distilling. That's the old moonshine pump. The old moonshine pump. The boss used to run distilling. That's for pumping beer. <laughs> Warp. Yeah, Warp. It's a distiller's beer in. This is like a, you got probably what 55 gallons, That's 60, 60 gallons 65 in here. Gallon. Now it looks like it's blue in color. It's right here, 65. Yeah. So and this we got uh, we got the drain valve and we got the fill the fill line over here. So it makes it is this maintain constant level here? No, no, no. So you use this to fill up the, uh, yeah. the fish tanks. See, exactly. Why does it look blue? This water, it comes from this machine. That's your RO? Or just filters? Wow. Well, I got this over here. Sediment filter, dual carbon filter, wow. dual reverse osmosis membrane. And then I run a deionizer. It's a resin bed. 
and this brings us down to zero total dissolved Solid solids. solids. That piece over there is will make it down to about three to seven TDS. Yeah. Total dissolved solids. Wow. You know, because the so boss if called I, me if a, I shut this off. And it just okay. shuts. Then we go to the tap. And this is RO water right. only. This is good drinking water, right. good for ice, very clean. So I have to thank the boss. He and told me if I turn this off and bring this back on, then I fill the tank. When the tank comes to level, I got a float valve on there. Shuts it off. And she shuts off automatically. Yeah, I see it. Nice. <laughs> where did you get the uh, Where did you get the tank? The guy that set up my tank brought this over. And then he left it here for a period of time, and I said, I'll give you a hundred bucks for that tank. Good idea. Now, this is a pro-grade tank. Yeah, it looks you like it. See you the can see the ones at the experience. Yeah, you can tell the thickness of the plastic is good. The ones at the aquarium, this is a 65. The ones at the aquarium store could be like 2,000 gallon tank. But it's the same plastic tank, same design. It's all, it's, it's top end. So what's going wrong with the, what happened over at the... Uh, the first system? thing that happened was, is my RO machine broke. Hmm. Reverse it osmosis. It was an under sink unit. Yeah. It was not designed for this duty. So it was just continuously, it was a stop and go thing, right? So you just had to continue? It just plugged up too often. Too much solids. Because you get too much solids, exactly. Wow. Okay. And plus I added the resin bed. I put a booster pump under there, we're running 80 PSI. So at 80 PSI, running it through those filters, I really only get this. Yeah, because it's it's got a tremendous amount of work to do to get the, even that. At 80 PSI, yeah. I get this trickle. Isn't that, that crazy? Like a, usually a house is like f between 40 and 60 PSI, so that thing's working hard to push that through that filtration. Boss told me change the filter in your refrigerator. Then, uh, <laughs> oh wow, that looks cool. Look at that. Well, look at the oh. lights. Man, that looks really cool. And I think you can definitely see one is purple, and one is aquamarine. I have to sit back. And a they're bit. receiving the same, uh, the same signal. Your same, same command signal. This looks like Monterey Bay worthy. <laughs> Doesn't yeah. it? Doesn't it look like Monterey yeah. Bay? This thing to charge to come Holy in smokes, at. that's what it looks like. Yeah, I mean, is that pro level, so, Bobby? Yeah. Wow. Definitely, definitely high end. That's like something you would Now, the Vortec. So, if you guys want to know, just this light $760, just the square piece with the lights. This guy here crapped out. Yeah, that's. Uh, I just put the new one on there. That's five hundred bucks. You were under warranty though. Rare earth magnets. It worked through three quarter inch glass. They driving a driving a turbine. Because the wire does not go inside the tank. Right. Electrical uh, risk. This is external drive through three quarter inch. Most definitely pro grade. Dang. Definitely high then I got the new toilet paper roller. Yeah, I saw that. Now, what's the deal on this? It thing? doesn't work. <laughs> That's a deal. Never worked from the day I put it in. I'm waiting on parts. Okay, well, if it did work, what would its function be? It I don't have to change 30 to socks. But I keep saying. Oh, it's just, just okay. In. See, I'm running on the socks when we went back to play. You have to pull the, yeah, you got to pull the socks and clean them. So, all this is going to change. Wow. Because it's supposed to automatically move. Why don't you get one of these? And he, he's like, I'd have to call the boss. Yeah, the <laughs> next thing over, over here. <laughs> you want the boss? <laughs> it's like, the next thing over here, you'll see uh, it's going to be a redesign. I'm going to put an ultraviolet sterilizer in there. Oh, yeah, something else. Well, you even got a battery backup in here now. Yeah. Holy smoke. <laughs> That's for the fan, for the fan when the, if the power goes I out. I got my CO2 hooked up. I oh, know, that's for the plants. 
<laughs> That's for the plants. So we don't have to worry about them. Well, all right, there it is. Dying. Else so we got? what happened through the winter is my RO system went down, so I used okay. the tap water. We'll take a nap. So what happened, using chat tap water is fine, it is good, but I had what you call total dissolved solids creep. It just creeped up more and more over the months, and it just Meaning. damaged my plants. Okay. I had an algae bloom, just terrible algae I couldn't keep up. So it's that it's that fine a balance between Whoa. even creep of total dissolved solids you going bring up. It down. Wow. All right. So what do we got here? What's our latest toy? I don't here? know. Jen's got to open this right. and do some work. <laughs> <laughs> what are day? It's Christmas time <laughs> in the city. Let's plug it in and see. You know you don't get a day off. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I got to plug it in and see which All one right. out of the three matches. Now, you got a new one because okay. we have a light matching problem here, right? Where's the light? Because There's you can see it actually looks a little bit there. purple on this side is where it's blue on that side. So there's a bit of a mismatch there. Come on, Janet, get on it. <laughs> <laughs> It's like what day off? <laughs> I work harder though. <laughs> there, okay. There's the new unit. Bring it around. See if you can find that cord. find a video from 2014 first time we went over here the boss Janet and I we had all kinds of flies that were <laughs> gone crazy at the place I don't think we'll have that today came to join you for yeah. still all the, way down. Down. the plate's still there well, they left their stuff right so well when Rosie and I were coming we were leaving Santa Rosa and Caltrans was on the side of the road they're all sitting there taking a break taking a break, <laughs> taking a break. <laughs> yeah <laughs> Bobby said, what a cush job. You retire, and uh, what was your job? I was just picking up bags from the side of the highway, <laughs> yeah. right? Yeah. All right, so we are on our way. It's uh, turning into a beautiful day. It's gonna, The weather's going to get funky in the next couple days. But for today, we will enjoy it. This is our... I, I think we're getting one more, one more storm. This, yeah, is our, this is our Easter visit, everybody. There's been more clouds than the sun. There's the Janet. Hey. <laughs> There's Bobby. Uh, Boss is angry, right? <laughs> it should be more school property. They got the Board of Education office. They got the library. Uh, Fairfield Police Substation. They got the Boss library. Is like too many, uh, too many people moving into the area. They now. got a child care center over there. And then in the middle of it all, they're going to put like, I don't know how many apartments do you have. Now, the thing that surprised me about Fairfield, just to let you guys know in the chat, was something. how you don't really think of it as hilly because, well, we have some hills in Santa Rosa, but uh, there's a lot built into the slopes here of housing and stuff, but it's all, you would never build houses like these days. They would consider it too wasteful of land to, to give somebody 5,000 square feet or something, right? Yeah. Not anymore. Those days are gone. But these are nice houses. The whole area is nice. So the boss is very touchy about the about the hood, right? That's it. Boss is like, 
keep those. Yeah, <laughs> that's not. <a> good <laughs> don't. I'll pay. I'll pay for that later. Yeah. Don't, don't. Don't ever tell people. <laughs> <laughs> the, the boss don't <laughs> yeah, know like that. <laughs> Hey, here we go, guys. Manka's Corner Grill, and this was the place we came in 2014. It looks a little, I think we sat on this side over here. I'm not sure. But, uh, nice looking place. I can't remember if the food was good or not. I can't really remember. Watch your step, Rosa. Yep. <laughs> That's it. Look a bit busy today. Doesn't matter to me any. Whatever you want. Whatever you want. That's the one I was telling you about. That's it, the, with the eggs on it. Like, oh, that was terrible, man. That was awful. Did you see that side, too? Did you see that side, too? All right. Here we go. Oh, Got the fish and chips there. Thank you very much. That looks pretty good. Grilled cheese and tomato soup. How's that look, Bobby? That looks good, huh? That does that look good. Steak. How's that look? Wow. How's that look? tacos so everybody help yourself if you want to get some chips what is that a uh, prime rib sandwich very good guys that was a good uh, good feed at manka's corner there we're going to just head across the street here they have this little antique huji bop over here all around. This is really a lovely county, Solano County. I actually think it's more, more of a treasure than uh, Napa County. Bobby, don't you think uh, Solano County is a little cooler than Napa County? Oh yeah, and, you I know? would say definitely. Yeah, because Napa is all winery. Solano County uh, has a lot of cool stuff to see here, right? So I think it's more of a hidden treasure than uh, Napa County. Antiques, let's look around inside here. Yeah. Stuff for sale. Fairfield. I don't even know where we oh you're here we're up here. Sassoon Valley. Cool stuff. I want to quit Winners Harold's Club Vegas. Have a drink on me. <clears throat> Typical antique place around here. Some cool stuff. They even have an outside part here. Some of these skillets are really, there's an old lodge there. 
for people to collect. 100 bucks. Griswold. I don't even know what the heck this thing is. Typeset machine. Graphotype. Weird. Old balance. I guess this is in grams. Pretty cool. You can just leave this stuff out in the weather. Man, it's nice junk, huh? Nice junk. Look at all the golf. Look at all the. Uh, holy smokes. Look at all the golf clubs. Let's see a couple of nice drivers, huh? Man, look at all the golf, look at all the golf clubs here. I've never seen so many clubs. I guess it just stays out in the rain here. Uh, maybe. It's so. tough on the golf bags, you know. You need some horseshoes, Janet? Oh, yeah. My, my shoes uh, you better get some new shoes and we'll get some new ones. Look at all these old time drills. Man, I remember yeah, one, of, I remember one of these growing up. We had one of these. Real old school stuff. Here's this Royal Crown. You gotta get some they got, right yeah, they it. got the rainwater inside of them. RC, uh, RC yeah, RC Cola. There's a lot of cool stuff here. Alright guys, I'm gonna think this is a quick little look. I'm gonna just gonna get away from the recorded music, but uh, very cool little place here. Look at this, guys. The perfect, perfect tractor for the rancho. Look at this baby. And Alice Chalmers. Good news is, guess how much? 800 I'm sure if you offered 500 in cash, they would tell you to load it up. Look at this baby. Just look at those tires. That, Dry rod, but isn't that cool? Old Alice Chalmers. Wouldn't this be fun to do a restoration here? And then it's got the starter there. It's got that nice smell. I don't know what about the gearbox there, how what kind of shape that's in. That's your distributor. Power crater engine. That's pretty cool. Probably a 45 horse. Who knows? That's what I'm talking about on the rancho right there, guys. We be in high cotton. This looks like we lost our coolant connection. Pretty cool. This is the oil bath air cleaner. So this is from the 1950s or 40s when they still used oil bath air cleaners. But pretty cool. Be nice to have something on the rancho complete with the bees nests that were built inside there. Right, that place was area. pretty cool. Yeah, yeah they, they were showing us when uh, they went. What was the episode? There's an episode of Pawn Stars. The some safe. What about the safe? The mystical safe or something like that on Thompson Pawn Stars. And they had a nice vintage, uh, nice Honda from the 70s. That uh, they came all the way. They took it to Las Vegas to sell, but the guys were too cheap didn't want to pay for it so That's... he was talking about, about how uh what would you say impolite uh, uh rick harrison's son was Corey, when he came in and uh you know, but, but also the guys from american pickers came in there too oh, wow. and they said that they were just like they are on uh just like they are on tv which was good to know bobby's like i don't need any john cook oh, yeah. so, what, what do you say for christmas bobby don't buy, don't me, any buy me any crap for Christmas. 
All right, well, it's had a great visit so far here today. So we're Very heading good. back. Oh, by the way, did you hear when she said, uh, oh, he's, Corey stood there like he, like a man that knows everything. I think, who does that remind you of? It didn't know anything. <laughs> who does that remind you <laughs> Remind you of it, right? You can't get one over on the boss. That's for sure. All right, Bobby and I are going to take off. Thanks for a wonderful. Uh, we loved coming down and doing a little Easter Maybe visit. More often. <laughs> well, stay tuned. You don't know what's coming up, but I do. So. Yeah, yeah we never know what you're going to. Love do. you. And good love to you see too. you. You don't know what's coming up. All right, Bobby. Where the hell are you? Shut up, Rosie. Shut up, Rosie. There That's. Is. That's a standard. <laughs> yeah. That's right. Oh, you talk too much. T-shirt says, "Shut you, up, Rosie." You talk too much all the time. All right. <laughs> you keep pushing well, me around. Oh, you're all right, there thanks we for go. Coming. Oh, yeah, thank you for lunch. Better. All right, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Ooh, eat your <laughs> chocolate bunnies. I got some goodies to take home too. All right, take care, everybody. Thumbs up or appreciated.